My name is Jen, you are here for Bodyweight Boot Camp. Hopefully you found me over on our YouTube channel. My apologies for those of you who usually join via Facebook. Today, I think it maybe thought it was April Fool's Day instead of uh, February 1st. So hopefully you have migrated on over and we'll have that problem fixed uh, by next week when you join in. Welcome to your virtual Y, where your YMCA of the North instructors are offering on-demand and live classes for you as part of your membership. So if you currently have your membership on hold or get, get it reset up, you can do that online. You don't even have to call anybody or go into a branch, and that'll give you access to at least six streaming classes per day, and then a content of 100 plus on-demand classes as well, all part of your membership. So you are here again for Bodyweight Bootcamp today. We have about 40 minutes. We're gonna work hard with some Tabata intervals, and then some timed bodyweight intervals. Today is, besides being February 1st, it's also National Get Up Day. So we're going to practice a little bit of getting up off the floor because I think that's important to help lift yourself up both physically but maybe uh, mentally as well. Sometimes there's a day that you just need to have a little get up in your life. But even more importantly than National Get Up Day, it's also the start of Hot Dish Month at my house. So any true blue Minnesotan is going to know that uh, hot dish is a very important part of our uh, 
dietary repertoire. So we're celebrating Hot Dish Month uh, starting today at my house. So hopefully you'll come celebrate with me too and make a hot dish uh, of your own for supper some night this week. I'm going to get our music queued up, make sure that you've got some space around you to work, and we're going to get moving. Nice, easy march to begin. I'm going to make sure we have a nice full warm-up because once we get started with our Tabata intervals, those are pretty high intensity, so I want us to be warm. If you haven't done any Tabata before, it is a series of exercises with a short burst of work and then an even shorter burst of rest. We're going to do two different Tabata intervals and then some body weight strength and then back to two more. Let's turn this into an easy jog if that feels okay or a march. And if this is your first bodyweight boot camp class with me, hello and welcome. I strive each week to do something a little bit different and to demonstrate to you how we can do exercise just with our body weight. Good, another 10 seconds here on this nice easy jog. Step those feet down, left foot's gonna sink to the side, sink into that hip. Same side. Practicing a little lateral movement. Feeling a little bit of a dynamic stretch through the inner thigh and the hip. Good, four more this side. Chest stays tall, toes point forward. One more on this side and then we'll switch. All right, right leg. I hope your energy is feeling great so far today. And maybe now I have you thinking about hot dish, right? Never too early to start planning supper. <laughs> Four more this side. Back to that easy jog here. So the idea or the trick with our Tabatas, we have eight rounds. It is 20 seconds of work and 10 seconds of rest. When you are working, you go that whole 20 seconds. It's gonna maybe hurt a little bit at the end, but we're working four minutes nonstop. So it's 100% work and then 100% rest. Go ahead and stop that jog, step and reach. I'll turn sideways. I'm giving myself just a little bit of a hip flexor stretch, reaching up through the arms and shoulders, warming up the upper body. Spine is tall and lifted. Good, give me four more here. Four, three, two. We're gonna hug those knees in one at a time, hugging the right knee and then the left. Give yourself a little march in between. A little knee hug march. Good. Looking good, four more here. Last one. And then you're gonna give me just a side step, right and left. Feet can stay connected to the ground, or maybe it's a little bit of a leap land. Good, another 15 seconds here. I want you to feel like the body is warm, the heartbeat has accelerated, your breathing rate has accelerated. There we go, four, three, I'm gonna ask you to kick your heels to your butt, same thing here. Feet can stay connected, or there can be a little bit of a hop. We're just getting the body energized and ready for work. Four, three, two, back to that jog. One more time. Here's where you can check in with yourself and see if anything is tight. 
not feeling so hot, maybe shoe needs to be a little tighter. 10 seconds here on this jog. Looking great. Four, three, two, and one. We should feel warm. Go ahead and grab a little gulp of water if you need to. I'm gonna get my stopwatch ready. Our first Tabata is jumping jacks. So you can do a full, typical jumping jack that looks like this. If the full jump doesn't feel good for you, here's an option for a half jack or hands even to the front. We've got eight rounds. That means 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. All right, friends. Eight, seven, I like to go to the beat of music. Four, three, two, let's go. 20 seconds, fast as you can. Way to push. You've got this. The first couple are gonna feel decent. It's when we start going into oxygen debt. Three, two, one, 10 seconds. That's gonna be hard to maintain. Three, two, one, let's go. Think about full body movements, fast. There you go. I like what I'm seeing so far. Light on your feet. Three, two, one. Whoo. Three, two, one, let's go. Nice push. 20 seconds, all out energy, all out effort. Quick landing on those feet. Woo. Three, two, one. 10 seconds easy. Ah, three down, five to go. Four, three, two, let's begin. Way to push. Remember, this is always an option too. Or hands to the front if that shoulder's bugging you. There you go. Great hustle. Three, two, one. Woo. Four down, four to go. How you noticing it? Three, two, one. Catches up with you, right? So we are creating a state of oxygen debt where our body has to find a different way to get its energy. That's why it's only 20 seconds long. Good push, good push. Woo. Three, two, one. Ah, five down, three to go, team. You're looking great so far. Three, two, one, let's go. Awesome. Keep it coming. Woo. Nice job moving those legs. Three, two, one. Ah, two more. Three, two, one. You got this. Good way to dig. Come on, come on, all the way through. That whole 20 seconds. Three, two, one. Woo, I don't know about you, my calves are getting tight. One more. Three, two, one, let's go. Nice job. We will be down for a running man for our second set. You can stand for running man instead if that weight on your shoulders doesn't feel so hot. Five seconds. Three, two, one. All right, we're gonna take just 30 so I can demonstrate for you. You'll be here 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off, or if you wanna climb, 
vertical, you certainly can too. All right, friends, 10 seconds, eight rounds. Woo. Decide you're gonna be on your hands or you're gonna be climbing up. Ready, go. Come on. Quick feet, knees drive into your chest. Push, push. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Whew. You don't have to stand up because we're right back down again. Second set of 20. Three, two, one. Let's go. Spread your weight throughout your hands. Pull those knees in. Quick choppy legs. Whew. Three, two, one. Ah, oh, is it catching up to us? Round three. Ready? Go. Whoo. Way to push, team. You're looking strong. Three, two, one. Whoo. All right, we got him. Halfway there. Three, two, one, begin. Whoo. You should be breathing hard. I know I'm not the only one breathing hard here. Five seconds. Three, two, one. How we doing? Whoo! Now we're halfway done. You got this. Oh. Ready? Three, two, one. Here we go. Four more to go. Then we transition to something different. Awesome power. Come on. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Oh, those shoulders, I'm gonna stand. You don't have to, you can stay in the ground. My shoulders are taking a beating. Four, three, two, let's go. Climb that ladder. 20 seconds here. Way to push. Leave it all out there. Six seconds. Woo. Three, two, one. Awesome team. Two more. Four, three, two, let's go. Uh. Is it a bit of a struggle? <laughs> Come on, let those arms and legs work together. Or if you're on the ground, strong core. Beautiful job. Three, two, one. One more, one more. Whew. You got this. Look yourself in your phone or your computer and say, I got this. Three, two, one, let's go. Uh. Way to climb. Or you're down here. Come on, let's finish, seven seconds. Four, three, two, one. Grab yourself a drink. Take a little bit of an active walk. We're gonna transition to our next part of class. We come back for two more Tabatas. And you know one of them is gonna be burpees, right? All right, friends. I'm gonna give you a number of exercises to complete. You're gonna have a number of seconds to complete them. And then those seconds are gonna get a little bit shorter. So we start with 10 squats and five push-ups. 10 squats and five push-ups. You're gonna have 45 seconds. 45 seconds to get those done. It's not gonna take you 45 seconds. So when you're done, you're gonna get up 
and do an easy jog. Then we'll have 45 seconds for 10 squats and five plank ups. All right, 10 squats, five push ups, 45 seconds to get it done. That's plenty of time. Four, three, two, here we go. 10 squats, just a body weight squat. You do have to count for yourself. Unless you're gonna go at the same pace as me. That's five, six, seven. You're gonna go right down to push ups, five of them. And when you're done with your push ups, you stand and jog in place. So we've got 20 seconds left till we start our second round. If you're finishing up right now, way to go. Second round, 10 squats, five plank ups. You'll start plank position, you'll be down, down, up, up. Three, two, one, 10 squats. So the squats stay the same. There's four, five. Then down for five plank ups. I'm still catching my breath from my Tabatas. Whew. When you're finished, you're up for an easy jog. Plank ups can be done from your knees too. Last set at 45 seconds, 10 squats, five rolling sit-ups or regular sit-ups. Not the full get up yet, unless you feel like you're ready for a full get up. Three, two, one. 10 squats. Then you're down on the floor for a sit-up, a rolling sit-up, or if you think you can get some get-ups in, that means standing all the way tall. Seven, eight, nine. You can since it is National Get-Up Day. This is what a get-up looks like. Get up. Can you get five of them in the time that's left? Or maybe you're here. Here we go, two more. And then you're jogging. All right, team, those are our three intervals. This time we've got 40 seconds to get them done. So it'll be 10 squats, five push-ups. Four, three, two, let's go. So we're shaving five seconds of time off but we're not decreasing the reps. Push-ups are next. Five of them. Eight, nine, 10. When you're done, you jog in place. So you only have 40 seconds to finish instead of 45. So less time between the intervals. Get them a little sneaky. 10 seconds to finish. 10 squats, five plank ups, 40 seconds. Three, two, one, let's go, 10. Way to work, seven, eight, plank ups. Starting that top plank, elbows are down, elbows are up, five of them. Good power. And then you jog. Ooh. 10 seconds, we start again. 10 squats, five sit-ups, or five get-ups, or five rolling sit-ups. Three, two, one. 10 of these first. Nice form, eight. Sit-ups, rolling sit-ups or get-ups, five of them. Ugh. I cannot get up without having my legs crossed. It's some weird, I don't know, Ugh, that's a challenge. Stay jogging. Seven seconds, we go again. This time four, or excuse me, 35 seconds. Same amount of reps, less time. Four, three, two, begin. 10 squats, five push-ups. 35 seconds to get them done. Six, seven, five push-ups. 
Woo! Time is shorter. That means you're gonna have less time for your jog. Before you go right back into it again. Woo! Five seconds. 10 squats, five plank ups. Three, two, one, let's go. So it's kind of a double whammy, right? Because we're already tired. And then I'm taking away time. But we can do this. Plank ups, five of them. Keep it coming. Get those five plank ups in and then come up for an active jog or active march. As you can see, I'm taking a water break, so you can always take a water break when you need to, too. Team, four, three, two, 10 squats, five sit-ups. There maybe wasn't much of a rest, huh? Five sit-ups or the get-ups if you can sneak them in there. You only have got 35 seconds. Or a rolling sit-up. Maybe you wanna try a get-up with me, huh? Come on, yeah. Ugh. Jog in place when you're done. Oh, we've only got two seconds. Back to the squats. 30 seconds. 10 squats, five push-ups. Come on. This is our last round of all three of these. Whew. You might have to kick it up a notch. Five push-ups at the end of those 10. Hop it down. Let's go. Good transition. Five seconds, 10 squats, five plank ups. Three, two, one. So I've asked you to cut 15 seconds of time off. No small feet. But you're here in boot camp, you're doing it, right? Nine, 10 plank ups. Whew, up and down, five of them. Ugh. Push through with me, come on. Six seconds. Squats and sit-ups. Three, two, one. Ten squats. You're looking amazing. Awesome job. Eight, nine. Rolling sit-up all the way up. Regular sit-up. Five of them. Ugh. Nice job, team. Oh, 27 seconds, that's cutting it close. Grab yourself a drink. We promised two more Tabatas. We're gonna do burpees first, and then we've got shuffling. So you've got eight more minutes of work, broken into four minute chunks, broken into 20 second chunks. Take another 30. I want you to feel fully recovered. Well, not fully recovered, two thirds of the way recovered, how about? So burpees first, couple options for your burpees. You're just watching. You might be all the way down, which means you won't get as many in, huh? It's a strategy. Or hop back, hop up, or step back. 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest. I guarantee you these are just gonna all blur into each other. All right, I'm trying to get myself psyched. Burpees are hard. Here we go, team, four. Three, two, let's go. But it's only 20 seconds. So you might get like five in. Or more. Whoo! Three, two, one. 10 short seconds of rest. Uh. Three, two, one. One, let's go. Second set. This is your power bell, team. I believe in you. You're here because you want a challenge. Plus, you're in your garage, right? So nobody can see what you're doing. Three seconds. Ah, good job. Oh, two down. 
three, two, one. It might help to just kind of turn your brain off and go somewhere else. Let your body do the work without thinking about it. And just wait for me to tell you when we're done. Done. <sighs> Hanging in there. I know you're giving me a virtual thumbs up. Three, two, one. Remember, if this was easy, everybody would be doing it. <sighs> it's a challenge, but doesn't it feel great to push yourself? Done. <sighs> Four more. We've got these. Three, two, one, begin. How you doing if you're bringing that chest all the way down? Woo! Or maybe you've got to jump. Come on, one more here. Done? Huh. You know, there's some classes that all it is is tabata. Three, two, one. That, my friends, would be a challenge. Rock stars, let's keep pushing. Like I said, just turn that brain off. Done. Two more, two more, two more. Yes, Jen, whatever you say. Three, two, one, let's go. Maybe you wanna face a different way in your space to look at something else. <laughs> Woo! I love your intensity. Come on. Done. Last one. You don't need to change anything. Three, two, one. Let's do it. Woo. Yeah, yeah, push. Come on, five seconds. You got two more for me. Come on, come on. Done. Uh. Water break. One more set with shuffling. I don't know about you, but I'm very glad we did the burpees already. We're gonna shuffle back and forth. Or if you've got a tight space and you need to maybe shuffle at the angle, that works too. Hey friends, maybe you started this class and you're like, this isn't for me, but what else is out there? Six other, five or six other classes a day that you can access with your YMCA membership. Nine o'clock in the morning, noon, four o'clock at night, five o'clock at night. We've got yoga with Davey, studio strength with Lisa, Pilates with Linda, the whole gamut, meditation. So check it out. You can also learn a little bit more about your instructors on the instructor bio sheet down at the bottom of that page. 10 seconds. Our shuffle is just gonna be constant. Four, three, two, let's go. It might be a little easier if you have a little more space to go. You don't have to do so much stopping and going. Come on. Can you stay low? Come on, eight seconds. Whew. Three, two, one. We've got this, we've got this. Three, two, one. Like I said, if you've got a little more space to travel, I only have about nine feet. So I'm doing a lot of starting and stopping, which is all right, that's good practice. Three, two, one. But if you've got a little bit more of a space, go ahead, challenge yourself. Two down, 
Six to go. Three, two, one. Remember, we are creating oxygen debt or oxygen deficit on purpose. You shouldn't really be able to talk as evidenced by me, right? Whew. Stop. Whew. Three, two, one. Let this music carry you. Come on. Oh, how are those legs doing? Ah. Stop. Four down, four to go. And then just a wall sit to finish us off. Piece of cake. Piece of tater tot hot dish. Ready? Go. I love it. I love it. Come on, come on. We're in this together. And you are feeling uncomfortable. You do feel like you want to quit. You get to quit right now. Excuse me. Three more. Ready? Go. The rest never seems like enough, does it? Here we go. Let that base drive you. Push, push. Quick feet, quick arms. Whew. Stop. Ah. Two more. You're doing awesome. Ready, go. I don't even have time to give compliments. Ah. Come on. Three, two, one. It's kind of fun to disappear off screen. So if I got any little ones doing this workout, where's Jen? She's coming back. Three, two, one, let's go. Last one, team. Ah. Great focus. Ah. Come on, push, push. Ah. You got this. Three, two, one. Ah. Grab a drink, stay moving. We will transition to a wall sit. We did two and a half minutes last week. So of course, we need to do at least that today. We'll go for two and a half. Ah. How are we feeling? We should be out of breath, uncomfortable, legs are tired, lungs are tired. Just stay moving, another 30 seconds here. That heart rate slowly comes down. That breathing slowly regulates. If you're at the phase where you're doing short, short breath like this, even though that feels like it's helpful, really try to exhale and create space in your lungs. I know it doesn't feel good to kind of hold your breath and but then that gives a lot more room for that fresh oxygen. All right, take a look around you. What do you have got for a space? A wall, a kitchen counter, a door. Two and a half minutes. No joke on these wall sits. And I'll make sure I got my real time going here. All right, friends, 10 seconds, we'll get started. Ah, four, three, two, come on down. Now is the time that I should probably talk about more hot dishes, right? So if you're not from Minnesota, a hot dish is a casserole. I would argue that the casserole is the dish that the main dish goes in, what it gets baked in. Hot dish has to have a protein, a starch, a vegetable, and then usually some sort of creamy something to put them together. So an example, would be tater tot hot dish. Your protein is hamburger or impossible burger or whatever you're wanting to use for your protein, black beans. Your starch is the tater tots. 
I put corn in my tater tot hot dish. I know that's a big um, area of argument. Is it corn? Is it mixed vegetables? Is it green beans? And then cream of mushroom soup. Gelatinous gets it all together. It's a real stick to your ribs meal <sighs> with lots of leftovers and leftovers are even better. We are one minute in my friends. <sighs> How we feeling? Sweaty now maybe? Legs are tired, lungs are tired. The Tabatas that we did are not something that you want to do every day or even something that's going to be healthy for you every day. When you train like that, it takes your body physiologically a little bit of time to recover. So every day is not a good idea. Give yourself 48 hours in between. Just like with weightlifting, you don't want to lift every day or the same body parts every day. Minute 30 in, one minute to go. Looking great. And if you like this class and you're wanting more classes or some afternoon options, make sure you get logged into your virtual Y. You can find that on ymcathenorth.org. And then up on the top blue, it says virtual Y. And you'll log in with username and password. Chances are you already have one, even if you don't know what it is. And there's a phone number you can call to um, check that out. Or there's a little link that says, send me my username. 30 seconds then that will get you into our catalog of all of our previous classes. So if there's a favorite one that you missed or want to do again, and then all of our live classes. Oh, team 15. Whoo, how are those quads? Oh yeah. Well, I am very proud of you. It has been a pleasure to exercise with you today. Thank you for joining me on National Get Up Day. Four, three, two, let's get up. Give yourselves a high five and celebrate the rest of your day. Thanks everybody, please take a couple minutes to stretch, rehydrate, get yourself feeling good for the rest of the day, and I will see you next week, Monday, 7 a.m. Bye everybody.